Welcome back, family, friends, and fellow gamers to Game Bros playing Torchlight 2. We're heading to Crow's Pass. Crow's Pass. Sorry, looking at John's screen, I'm like, I don't know where we're going. Because <laughs> the loading screen doesn't say that. Um, yeah, we're. I think we're heading to the Frosted Hills. Oh no, it's blue. There is slow, S slow. There is snow. Um, let me let me attack stuff alone for a little bit. Oh, to see how you're. Yeah, I want to see okay. what the difference is between. Okay, that that took a little while. I'll just wander on over here. Okay, because like one of the things does. Um, Eight dashers. Like I'm trying to compare two things, but it's like this one is has plus six ice damage and plus seven um, something else, and so I'm like, but it, so is that better than this other one? Because <laughs> it, it has kind of extra stuff. All right, well let me cut. Let me. Let, I want to stick together just so I can, you know, strengthen numbers and safety by yourself is what they say. No. Oh no, more cave dashers. That was a What's weird, that? like, weird rock thingy. Oh gosh, it like it that rock had a ton of gold in it. <laughs> Poor person. There's gonna, somebody's gonna be like, yeah, I, I stored all my gold in a rock. Nobody will ever okay, find so no, it. This is not. This doesn't look like it's better than, than your than your other. Yeah. I mean, is it the 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 um, sword versus my claws? Yeah, I, mean, I imagine the claws would be faster. Well, so no, like it's the DPS. 0. 0.72 seconds. But I do think it's just... I don't know, I think it's a combination of the other two things just overpowers it or, or mm -hmm. takes it, you know, makes it better. So I'm gonna do... it's fine. Oh no, little, little guys! So, this is a level... level like 12 to 13, guys, and Steven and I are not even... We're level 11. So we're a little... we're a little behind. And I'm not sure why, because there's not many quests. You know, and we, we're like killing everything, so... I don't know why we're not... I mean, we're not that... we're not like far behind, so it's not a big deal. But... Still, it... Oh, I thought those guys came back. I was like, what the hurt? Ooh, there's... what the... So... Fondo the Master. Alright, well, one second, Master. There's a bunch of spiders. No! There's a bunch of... Things. So, back to back to what I would do in oh, Ohio yeah. and whatnot. Fondo, hello. I love your food, by the way. Well, that's Fondue. Fondue. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. That's the other master. My, yeah. my bad. Fondue, the master. Um, so I would probably do. Oh, I would wait. do that. The rest oh, of that yeah. thing with, again. That would only be two hours. But one of the other things you saw was that uh, there were people doing like wind sailing and whatnot on the Ooh. Sea of Galilee. That just would be pretty cool. And just because I like that type of stuff anyway, but then I also just think it'd be cool to do it on the Sea of Galilee. <laughs> oh yeah, that would be cool. Master Enchanter. So if I give you this... Do I put it in there? No enchantment. Enchantment the, costs 600 the gold. Cost to enchant this item. Oh, and he attempts to enchant it. Okay. Oh. 500. Let me see if I can have him Go. enchant my... Okay. Yeah, sure. In turn, performs the ancient rites on the pistol and adds a new enchantments. Sweet. What did he add? What did he do? Plus five percent chance to execute. Ooh. Okay. I'll take that. So yeah, enchantment right, one plus four physical damage. Hmm. And enchant my boots. How much gold do I have? Ten thousand. Okay. Enchant. That's a new enchantment. This enchantment four is the ancient rites. Plus one decay. Okay. Enchant my pants. <laughs> Sorry, I took them off right in front of you, but. <laughs> Plus 2% focus attribute, but okay. I'm not gonna spend all my money there. That's just kind of cool. Oh, hey, a quest, finally. I need your help. Please help. Oh, dear little one wandered into that cave. My husband, Finneth. Oh, sorry, somebody's attacking. One second. All right, we'll come back, okay. master. I need your help. My husband, Finneth, ventured after them, but it's crawling with nasty creatures and he hasn't returned. I'm beside myself with worry. Okay, I'll, well, don't worry. You have received a quest. That's Why, why'd you give her a, a an old voice? How? Because she has white hair. I just assumed she was like an I don't know. All right, you want to go? You want to do that quest? You head into this. Where'd cave the master right go? Here? Where did he go? He disappeared. I just saw him and then he disappeared. Maybe, Maybe he's he... a a random. Could be. Whoops. 
Maybe he's a, yeah, let's go into the cave, dude. Let's let's help. Okay, let's find up, her up, husband. Oh, and, hello. It's up here. <laughs> All right. Well, don't worry, ma'am. I will go find your family, even if my glory-seeking friend. Good for nothing now. No. <laughs> yeah. So no. So so you said uh, parasailing on the Sea of Galilee. That would be your stuff uh, like that. I mean, that I, I don't like. I've never done. I've never gone parasailing, so that'd just be something to kind of try. But it, like, I've I've been kayaking, and there are people doing yeah. that, doing that as well. Um, and there actually were oh, areas you could camp, so that just to me would be kind of cool. You wait, you can't? Yeah, you can camp. Oh yeah, that would be cool. What what's the weather like there? Is it really hot? Or uh, is it... Well, it is. I mean, it's in the Middle East, so it is fairly warm, but. That's also in the summer, and so like they, that's one of the things that I think they're in more of the tropics, or I don't know uh -huh. exactly. Basically, he, he said that there's just two seasons. It was either winter, or you know, it's either winter and it's raining, like a lot, or it's not. <laughs> so like it didn't hmm. rain at all when we were there because it's one of those times at that point in the, in the year it does not rain. It's very rare for it to rain, so um, that's definitely something too. I was gonna say about yeah. like ten things regarding Israel, and I don't remember what they were now. Ten things I wish I top ten things you won't believe about Israel now. Yeah, you won't believe number eight. You know those stupid like trying to get you to clickbait and yeah, yeah. Oh man, I, come I, on, I really don't little... like it. Like there's just there's too many places that do it. Yeah, I'm getting health. My arm is just healing me, which is really cool. Your armor? Um, yeah, I have I have several armor pieces that. Uh, I mean that's good. You're you are kind of like the tank in the group. I'm more of like the healer slash DPS slash. Or do you heal no, at all? No, I don't. <laughs> I mean I'm not saying like you know, we're still working together even if even if I'm. Oh even, gosh, that know. is a giant winter widow. Ah. I'm taking you out, son. I'm gonna fall back a little bit just so I don't get. No, quit. I wish I could fire without mo Like, that's annoying. Ah! Okay, fall back a little bit. Now attack him, attack him. Fall back a little bit. He's gonna do a little, little attack. Take him out, take him out, take him out. <clears throat> yeah, I do, I do think Heather is healing me quite a bit. <laughs> Fame increased! Sweet. Uh, what is the? Man, I'm trying um, to remember what I was gonna say. I'm trying. I was gonna ask. Like, something. just ask me questions. It'll pop back oh, up well, again. What is the? How is it like? What's the sea level? Is it above sea level? Below sea level? Well, I mean, a, a lot of Israel is mountainous, but like, so the the western part is that's where this that's where the Mediterranean Sea is, and then as you go toward. Uh, oh, like go. as you go toward Jordan, which is actually the border between. Jordan oh, that's and Israel's the Jordan River, um, but you get uh, like you kind of go up from sea level up the mountains and then you go kind of down. So there's a mountain range kind of going through like from north to south, kind of through Israel, and from there hmm. on the other side of the world, or the other side of the world, haha, <laughs> on the other. I got a quest. How do I? Oh yeah, Q. Sorry. Are you robot Wait, parts? There's this. Wait, here. I, I will kill them. I will kill the spiders that are attacking you. <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. There's a, like, come up. Oh, no. What? Gosh, darn it. I didn't want to do that. Now, do I have to go all the stupid way back? Or it's not, not that like, far. It's, yeah, it's not that far, but still. There's um, a way up. Don't, like, go past him. Go, like, up. Because there's, like, a chest and, like, I got a, I got another quest. Oh, yeah, yeah, Called yeah. Robot Parts. So we might be able to build a robot. That sounds really cool. Yeah, Robot Parts. Um, so as you go east, you go up the mountains and then you go down and then down, 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 down past the sea level, and that's where the Dead Sea is. Like, have you ever heard of the the Dead Sea being the lowest place on Earth? Mm-hmm. Like it, it's so obviously besides caves. Okay. That's the lowest you can now be on the Earth. Going back to that. So it's like it's like fifteen hundred feet below sea level. Oh wow. So it's like a mountain below, like a you know, mountains are. Can be tall. It can be not as tall and whatnot. But yeah, it's like a small mountain's worth below sea level. 
Was that for my pet? How do I how do I go to my pet's 80. inventory? How do I, do you know how to open my pet's inv inventory? P. 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 Uh okay. I think I can put Yeah, this I don't there. think I have anything for uh -huh. him. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give him a collar. But this nice. one looks really cool. I got an enchanted oh, lucky mm, guy. per hit. Okay, can't I cannot pass that up. That's if that's useful. It was either a terrible decision or the best decision of my life. Poison. <laughs> it's I'm gonna, one I'm of the two. Oh, I leveled up twice? Wow. All right. Where do we have to go okay, now? I'm going to assume that one better because it just looks cool. We're assuming this is better. Uh, I'm going to... Hold on. Okay, I think we uh, I think we have to go up. Because according to the map, that's where the question mark Spider. is. Right? Yes, sorry. I assume... There's a little spider. Why is my... Watch vibrate. What's going on? Oh. So when you were hiking the mountain, you weren't like, oh, oh man, it's no, so no, hard no. to breathe. Or, the the okay. the highest point elevation wise, like besides the north part of Israel, there's the mount like mountains of uh, Mount Mount Hebron and other places. Like that lead basically leads to Lebanon. Um, that is higher, but like the highest place in Israel, I think it's like like Jerusalem. Is actually is is Jerusalem on Mount oh, Zion? Oh wow, that's a big that's a big spider. Is um, look, look, yeah, yeah, something. Um, Spits immobilizing webs, and they're swift. Well, not swift enough because he dead. But I think it's like three thousand feet above sea level. So I mean, not really okay, anywhere. Yeah. So, I mean, because like, I feel like most places on the Earth are not that low like they're not sea level you know if you go to like oklahoma i don't know what it's i don't know what it is but it's not sea level because there's not sea there that's how that works no <laughs> huh. i'm pretty sure it's not sea level anyway to the watch wheel temple when we became separated i was hoping to rejoin him at the temple but the doors had been sealed behind him he was very ill when i last saw him I think he might have contracted the same sickness affecting the other Astherians. I was planning to enter the Watchwheel through the other portal in the old Astherian refuge. Unfortunately, the keys have been stolen. Goblin miners took one, and we believe that some slavers who recently moved into the area have the other. It takes both keys to activate the Watchwheel portal, and it is beyond my abilities to retrieve them. Recover the passkey ember from the slavers and the latchkey ember from the goblins. You can use them to open the portal in the refuge and intercept the regent before he infects the guardian. Hmm. You have received a quest. Don't think they should be tr level f Okay, we can't do that yet. That's that's a little above us. Ooh, it's faster. Cool. Dang it. What are we going <clears> to... <throat> I mean... Where else can we go, man? That's the only quest we have. We have the robot parts one. What are, the, what are those? To the Enclave. Into the Widow's Veil. We could just go down there and do the Widow's... Unless that was that cave we were just in. Because I don't know what else to do. There's no other quest. I mean, we have the robot parts, but that's just like, search for robot parts. <laughs> we can't really... That's funny. It's just like we explore. Find and... the mysteries of the robot parts. How, Actually, there's more stuff. There's that? more stuff down here we can explore. There's more uh, undiscovered land. Yeah, I. I want a potion. Ooh, what's, okay. and that's that's to the enclave. So I don't want to go that way. I do want to go to Israel at some <laughs> point. I definitely would recommend it, I, and I, I would recommend going with Ooh, a guard. guide that is a Messianic Jew. Which there's actually not. That's sadly there's not that many that live in Israel. They all live in like the U.S. or something. Well, I or just know that there's places. there's not a huge amount that live in Israel. Like it just, I I think it's definitely higher than it was the like, years ago. But it's not like a fortieth of the population is. Like, no, no, no. Like there, there's a mm. lot of them are Jewish. But that's actually something I could talk about. I, and my knowledge is very, very, um, you know, small. But like, this is something that, you know, our guide has kind of talked about. Is that there? There are different. Bro, really like, quick. Do you want to? I ahead. guess. Should we just head head? Keep going with the quest. I mean, I don't is know. That the fourteen to fifteen. Yeah, I mean, I'm level twelve. It's thirteen to fourteen. So it's. Or no, that is fourteen to sixteen. Dang it! But I'm almost level thirteen. I mean, so where's? I, I think we're fine. 
What level are you? You're level 12. To the Enclave. What about that one? Enter the Widow's Veil? I think that's where we were when we were helping that old lady. So we already did that. Okay, yeah, let's just you move forward. Just I mean, I'm gonna... Yeah. I'm almost level 13, so it's not... It won't be, yeah, it yeah, shouldn't yeah. be too bad. So anyways, so you oh, were saying... Oh, I have skill points. Here. <laughs> I, need to, I need to use my skills. But you're talking about how there's different... Yeah, so just like G's, there's... Not a lot of... Just like there's different... Sorry, just like there's... Point activated. Um, I do health more. Yeah, I'm almost level... Th so you're almost level 14 or almost level 13? I'm almost level 13. Okay, okay. What are you? I'm about halfway to level 13. Okay. A little bit more than halfway. Where are you? There's no, there's no map. Oh, I guess it's not a map area. Just like there's denominations in, like, Christianity and whatnot, which, by the way, was not the intention. Yeah. Just, just saying, you know. Because, like, there's been multiple times where... I don't, I don't remember who it was. I think Steve was... We were, we were raising canes and talking with, you know, Locked people from church chest. and whatnot. But I don't remember who it was, but he was basically saying this is what this is you know someone's maybe you can, you can kind of help me remember i don't know exactly but uh like i don't know if it was a i don't know if it was here. a vision we need to figure out how to open it we have we need to find we need to kill the enemies to get the golden key yeah, um let's continue. Down so here. i don't know if it was like a vision or something along those lines um but basically someone you know god was basically talking to them and it had to do with it might have been. Oh gosh, my health is low! Run away! Other. Okay, alright, I'm fine. John, so I'm gonna quickly say it, but it's the whole, you know, God saying or Jesus saying. Again, I'm not sure exactly what it was, but it was, you know, person was like, oh, I can't. Oh yeah, so, had to do with someone, someone, um, saying like, oh, I want the, uh, I want the excitement and the passion that you know the these people have but i don't want this other thing that they they do because i'm a southern yeah. baptist or you know and nothing against baptist so i'm not gonna it was just the whole point was uh he he basically was asking god like please give me this but i don't want this thing because i'm a southern baptist and then god's response was what's a southern baptist yeah <laughs> because it's all man-made stuff all the all the denominations are all man-made yeah. now i'm not saying that you know I don't know. I'm not gonna say they're good, cause, eh. But anyway, it's when it comes to just anything, it's kind of like you. The only thing you need to be believing is not necessarily. I don't even say don't believe what a preacher says. Like, believe what the Bible says. Like the so if the preacher can't back it up, then don't believe what he yeah, says. Yeah, it's not you know? in the Bible. Then. Um, is there anything else? Yeah, there's more stuff down here. I mean, for stuff that's not in the Bible, that's. I don't know. It's a little bit different, I, I guess, to a certain extent. But I mean, there's plenty of things. There's a lot of guys right here. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I mean, I'm I'm that's that's towards the quest. I don't want to. I was gonna. Okay, there's nothing down here. I was trying to do some more um, exploring. Heather. Oh, okay, I'm gonna come up to you now. There's there no we else go. I can get. No else um, I can get in here. But anyway, so he was saying, you know, the denominations and and whatnot. So there was. There are denominations, or not, they're not called that, but basically different oh, types of things in the Jewish, you know, circles. And so there's, ah, run away. <laughs> there's some, there's some that are very, very uh, orthodox. And I don't know exactly what you would say orthodox is per se. Um, but like they, they hold to the, the kosher laws and whatnot, which uh, again, I guess, our guide has told us, and I, uh, there's other things that I could see that. Oh my um, gosh, it's telling us to go into the ember mine. The ember. 17? 16 to 17. Golly. We need to, we need to let's, explore everything yeah. until. Let's just kill everything. Hopefully, there's, we'll find more enemies. I wonder if this um, is a game. Is this a game where you need to, like, grind and just kill enemies to level up? I don't know. I mean, it could be, but I mean, I. I like, we've been kind of walking around other player areas we've been, and we haven't seen any enemies. <laughs> no. But like they hold to the kosher laws, they they ha basically they, they follow a whole bunch of. I mean, again, my knowledge is uh, limited, but from what I've been told and what I've seen and everything, 
a lot of man-made rules that the, that the kind of the rabbis have, you know, expounded on the laws of Moses and whatnot. And so mm. now it's just like insanely difficult to do yeah. anything properly. Um, and like one of one of the things our our guide had said, hey gold, was that so like one of the things that they don't do is what's part of the kosher law is eat eat meat and then eat cheese with the meat. They don't do that. Um, and that's a whole one of the one of the reasons is there's a scripture that talks about not boiling a young goat in its mother's milk and whatnot. And uh, one, like, so our guide, when he was talking about that, I had to do, he was saying that that was a delicacy in Egypt and other places. And so the, the scriptures that are around it talk is God talking about grain sacrifices or not sacrifice. Sorry. Grain offerings. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Killing the grain I will, plant. I will sacrifice this wheat, but you know, grain mm -hmm. offerings. And then he's, and then like the next scripture says, do not boil a young goat in its mother's milk. Like, so it, it's not talking about he, like the context is not him saying, oh, by the way, this is evil. Don't do this. Basically his, his point, our, our guide's point was that God's saying, here's what I want you to do. Don't do what you think I want you to do. Do what I told you. Like, so I'm not like humans and I'm not going to sit there and say, oh, this is a really, uh, d uh, delectable meal. So I, I'm, you know, I'm, uh, I'm pleased by your delectable choice of me meals and whatnot. Anyway, so that's a very mm. weird way to say what I was trying to say, but yeah. But yeah, anyway, so one of the, one of the things he was saying, you know, they don't, they don't do the meat and whatnot. Hi, people. Oh, wow. There's a bunch of guys. Black fist. Level up. Yes. Oh, sorry. I didn't want to talk to you. My bad. Oh, I guess like okay, whatever, fine. Okay, that is really uh, good. That's a better shotgun than I think I have, so I'll grab the shotgun. I guess we saved him. There's a guy hulking, hulking smasher. That's what it's called. <laughs> yes. All right, I'll be there in a that's sec. That's awesome. Oh, no, he's dead. Him? He's dead. He's dead. Oh. Um. But so anyway, one of the things is you know don't eat meat with cheese and whatnot, yeah. and so. If you are traveling, and it, what was the the rule has to do with? It's like every three hours. If you eat if you eat cheese, then you have to wait three hours before you eat any meat. I'm not sure where the three hours came yeah. from, but whatever. Um, so then it becomes a problematic if you're going to a, a like if you're traveling and you're going into a different time zone. Say you ate meat at oh my twelve o'clock. Yeah, it's it's ridiculous. But say you ate meat at twelve o'clock. Are there different time zones in Israel? No, 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 no. Oh. But I'm saying if you travel to a place and then when you get there, say you eat meat on the plane, but when you get there, it's going to be two o'clock, but it was three hours for you. So is that three hours or do you have to wait another hour? And I guess basically what our guide was saying is that, so what what's kind of come about because of situations like that, and there's probably a plethora of other things, but is that it gets to where the only person who's able to tell you whether or not it's okay is a rabbi. And so mm. you have to basically hire a rabbi in that city to be your rabbi for the time you're there so that any questions you have, you can ask them to say whether or not it's fine. Man. And that's like, okay, that's called oppression. Like that's exactly what that is. Yeah. And he, 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 that's what he used. That's the term he used. It's very, you know, wow. controlling and you know, it's, it's become a, it's almost become a lucrative business. Again, that's what I've just heard. That's what the but, yeah the Catholic Church did the same but, thing. But uh, well, we're gonna hold that thought. We're gonna next time it, and we're gonna continue exploring chest. and and leveling up. Ooh, gold, gold, Ooh, a gold, gold, ton gold. of gold. Yeah. I need to sell a bunch of stuff. Chest again. And, and yeah, we're we're gonna sell some. Wow. Stuff. Okay. Sorry. And, Go ahead. Uh, you're good. You're good. I can. So gosh. Okay. Yeah. We're gonna kill these guys, and then we're gonna we're gonna. Sell some so stuff. this gold, this chest on the right side had a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, I can't carry anymore. Okay. Then the chest on the left side had like twelve gold. I can't carry it. It's like I okay, so these these anymore. friends, they were pirate friends, and one of them just didn't want to share any of the loot. All right, I'm not I'm not pushing. Let's let's just stay here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're, good, we're good. We're good. Thank you guys for watching. We'll see you in the next episode. Have a wonderful day and be blessed.